Hello, my loves. How are you? Hope all is well with you guys. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. Guys, if you have not hit that subscribe button, it would mean the world to me if you hit that subscribe button for me. Um, today, I'm going to be doing a reading, and this is for my Aquarians, and this will be for September 13th through the 19th. And I'm filming this on Thursday. Um, so, today was the first day of school. So, I did my morning run. Um, I have time off in between, and I got to go back in and do my evening, or afternoon, I should say. And I miss those kids so much. Oh, my goodness. Just going back. Had an amazing morning. The kids were so cute. Um, I do special needs uh, children. So they were absolutely wonderful on the bus. Um, I have some old ones that um, have been on my bus for a while. And then I had uh, some, quite a few new ones. And these guys, oh, I just didn't realize how much I missed doing my rural route and going back and seeing my, my children. I call them my children. Um, they mean the world to me. They absolutely do. And I had a new little girl on my bus and she says to me today, oh, I had a little bit of time, um, before they came out to get the kids. So I went back and talked to the kids and this little one, she's new. I, first time I've had her. And she says to me, they're going to kill me. I was like, what? She says, because it's a, her, her first time at this new school. And she says, they're going to kill me. They're mean. I don't want to go. They're going to kill me. They're going to, I says, sweetheart. I says, they're not going to kill you. I says, the teachers here are so nice. I says, you will love them. And so I calmed her down. And so she was better. But, oh, she was a, a, absolutely adorable this morning. She was really afraid of going into school. Um, until I calmed her down. Oh my goodness. What a little sweetheart. So let's get on with your reading guys. Um, angels, guides, and spirits come to me. Can you tell me what my Aquarians need to know for September 13th through the 19th, please? Angels, guides, and spirits come to me. What does, what do my Aquarians need to know? for the week of the 13th through the 19th, please. But, oh, I had such a good morning. After all, everything that's been going on and all the pessimism that we've had and, you know, the anguish and everything, it just, it went beautiful. Couldn't ask for a better first morning for the kids. Okay, last shuffle, guys. We have <clears throat> Momento More. That is, you, everything must die. Things must die. We have the glove, and the glove is for not getting our hands dirty, right? We don't want to get our hands dirty about something. We have the horseshoe, which is for protection. So we have um, the syringe, and that is for healing. Um, the syringe is about an addiction. We need to get immunized. Um, it's about that addiction, that drug use, that immunization. Then we have the lantern. And the lantern is all about that guiding light and that clarity. We have a male influence. We have two spirit cards. <clears throat> we have uh, chiromancy. A chiromancy is all about your fate and your destiny. And we have the spirit board. And the spirit board is a message from the other side. Okay, so we're looking at a message that will be coming from the other side. Then we have the medical kit. Okay, the medical kit is all about he healing. Okay, so we have that healing that's going to be coming. Okay, maybe it's from this addiction. 
um, of some sort. We have that. Um, but everything must die. Things must end. So things are going to end. And we, we don't want to get our hands dirty. Maybe it's something that... Um, maybe somebody know somebody that we know has an addiction to something and we need to <clears throat> use that medical kit. We need to heal, but we don't want to get our hands too dirty in this situation. Okay. But we have some kind of a man influence or a masculine influence that's coming to us. Okay. So look for that masculine influence or that man that um, is coming in and we have that light, you know, we have that guiding light, that guiding light is coming. So we have a lot of light. We have a lot of spirit coming to us. Um, we have three cards here. Okay. So that spirit is coming. That spirit is looking out for you. That spirit wants to tell you something. They have a message for you. Okay. They have that. It's all about your fate. It's all about your destiny. What should you learn what should you know but we have that protection okay that protection is here so we want to <clears throat> we're not going to get hurt by any means um with this but remember guys things always come to an end it always comes to an end um if it's life you know if it's a an addiction if it is um, something to be healed. Um, but everything must come to an end. And it's telling you to, to make sure you look into getting your immunizations. Okay. Look into getting that flu shot. Maybe um, look into your records and make sure that all you are up to date on all of your shots. So that could be that medical kit also. But we have that and... For some reason, there's something that's going on in our life that we don't want to get our hands dirty in this situation, okay? And I have a very strong feeling it has to do with a male figure. Some male figure, maybe it is a friend um, of yours that has a male influence that maybe they have that addiction. Maybe they have that abuse and that anger. Um, but there's something saying that you don't want to get involved in it. You don't want to deal with it. You don't want to, you know, and you have that light. You have that guiding light help right behind you. You have spirit behind you. You have that message from the other side that's telling you what to do. You have that protection. Okay. Protection is here for you guys. So that's what I have for you. Let's pull an oracle card and see what the universe wants you to work on this week or what the universe wants you to know. Angels, guides, and spirits in the universe. Universe, what do my Aquarians, what do they need to know for the week of the 13th through the 19th? Okay, Aquarians. One more shuffle. We have new moon. So we have a promise coming our way. Okay. We have a ceremony. We have invocation. Okay. So something is going to be coming to you in some kind of a ceremony of some sort. Maybe it is a ritual that you are doing or some kind of a ceremony. Um, but it is a promise of some so sort. Okay, so we have that promise that's coming to us of maybe um, it could be a promise of love, could be a promise of marriage, maybe, 
could be a promise um, to God, but it could be a ritual that you do. Um, but something is coming in and it is going to be wonderful. It's going to be great. So don't forget to, to look at these cards and that beautiful promise is coming your way. Okay, guys. So I hope you like this. Um, if you did, please give me a big thumbs up. Um, and if you have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button for me. It would mean the world to me. And again, guys, if this does not resonate with you, be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising also. I love you guys. I hope you have a wonderful and a beautiful day and a gorgeous week. I love you. Until next time. Mwah.